Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, my name is Regina. Welcome and please, if you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Ring the bell as well so you can be notified every time I upload a video. So today I'm using my Valentino Pure Super Bond Primer to do my priming. Next, I will be coming in with a clear bead of acrylic to even out my nail surfaces so I can have a smooth surface to work from. And it also is good to have a surface to fall back to in case you want to change your design in future. If my voice sounds kind of cracked up, it's because I'm losing it. I don't know why, but I will do my best to do this voiceover for you guys because I haven't been like doing my videos lately and I wanted to make sure that I have something up for you guys. So that's what I'm going to be doing. After I finish this, I'm going to be picking out the colors. She is a fantastic young lady. She wanted to try out the glow in the dark colors. So we're going to be doing a multicolored set today. It's going to be fantastic. It glows so brightly and we're going to add a little bling and a little bit of fancy snatchy stuff so yeah let's get this popping paper okay okay so i'm going to be doing a, a kind of a ombre using why so flashy from my glam and glitz collection it is such a beautiful color and it has an amazing glow and these little butterflies, I got these off Amazon. Um, I will see if I still have the link for them. Or I will just try to get you a link for some butterflies. But they're colorful butterflies and they looked amazing. The pink I'm coming in with at the base is from Young Nails. And the, you can find Young Nails on um, Instagram. They sell amazing products. Very easy to work with. Very good for beginners as well. So after, you know, doing that, I'm going to go ahead and seal my creation in a bead of clear. And the clear I'm using today is from Mia Secret. And I like Mia Secret clear because it's really free-flowing. It's amazing to use. This finger I'm going to be doing a bunch of different colors in little patches and it's just gonna turn out really really amazing I'm um, just putting in a little bit of touch of every little color that I can use I think I'm using all the colors that I'm going to be using in the set today to do this design right here and it's not really a marble it's just me placing the colors in areas and letting it flow into each other um, they're not doing that much flowing, but at the same time, they're kind of blending together nicely, which I thought was a kind of a cute thing. Okay, so I thought it was a little bit boring, so I'm going ahead and add in a little bit of translucent glitter. Um, just to give it an extra splash when the clear goes over it and you look in the nail. It looks fantastic. Um, I will see if I have a link for this glitter, but I'm not so sure. But I will leave you a link for um, glitter flakes in the description below from Mia Secret because they are amazing. They're beautiful in your sets and they're perfect in Galaxy nails as well. But there I go, encapsulating it in my clear, and I'm going to keep it moving. Okay, I'm going to keep it moving, and we're going to move on to the next finger. Urra! Okay guys, so next I'm coming in with this beautiful blue pigment. It has such a fantastic glow and it just really popped this middle finger and I'm doing another ombre effect. I'm going to be adding some glitter as well 
and I'm using white at the base she said it looked like the beach and I cannot disagree with her I think it looks kind of beachy to myself but um, she really was liking this she was really enjoying everything she gave everything a name and I just really had so much fun doing her nails um, I started doing her mom's nails at first and she was like my daughter is losing her mind she wants her nails done so please hook her up and when she came in I was like all right then seat ya let's do this let's get you popping let's get you popping honey and I know she loved them and um, yes it was really looking like the beach because those little translucent turned green when I put the clear over them powders turned turn green so it really looked like you know under the sea with a little wave and a little glow in the dark um, made it even better she wanted to take a, take a look at it you know it was really pretty anyways moving on to the pointer finger I'm going to do a solid on this finger and I'm not sure which color I came in with I think it was the uh, oh this one is radiant and this one is also from the glam and glitz collection and I think it turned out it, it this is my favorite color I don't know if y'all know my my um, videos but I think I use this color the most in all my glow in the dark kits I think I use this sets I use this one the most I really love it and it's really not the easiest color to use because it's kind of translucent so you have to you know make sure you go over it time and time again but it really is such a beauty when you actually get it the way you want it it's such a beautiful color all you have to do is just you know fill out the spots listen you don't have to be perfect to get your beads in one bead when you're doing your nails make sure that you cover every inch of the nail and everything is perfect the way you want it and don't care how many beads you use to achieve this look it's how the nail looks after you're done the end that's the only thing that matters so I'm moving on to the thumb and um, this one is going to be a triple ombre like a triple ombre I'm starting out with the white at the tips and then I'm going to be using the oh, I'm not sure the orange okay I'm using this beautiful orange pigment that I made and it's so fabulous it's super pigmented and it has this amazing glow and then I'm going to be using why so flashy at the base from the Mia secret collection I'm also going to be adding some more butterflies to this nail just to tie in the nails together so the set don't look like you know it doesn't match up so I'm going to be adding these little butterflies and then I'm going to go ahead and encapsulate this nail in clear and then we're going to keep it moving on to the other nails okay so there I go adding the butterflies and trying to make sure that they're all turned um, the right way because I'm kind of crazy like that I like everything facing where the client themselves when they look at their butterflies they are upright to them and not not turned the other way to them like oh, turned upside it down just so everybody else can enjoy their nails this is not for them this is for you this is your nail set not anyone else's so I believe that when you look at it it should be upside up for you and not the other way around anyways I'm going to be moving on to the next hand and some of this hand was not in frame so well so I'm going to cut it out and I'm going to keep it moving and I'm sorry about that but as I said before um, I'm going to try to put up the other half of the hand on Instagram I'm just making sure that this this thumb is encapsulated nice and good.
Okay guys, so I'm going to be adding some crystals around the cuticle area of both of these nails. And because the middle one has no design and nothing at all for this, I'm going to be adding some crystals for that one as well. And then I'm going to finish off my set by using my Gucci Super Time Gel Top Coat. It's so amazing. If you have not tried Gucci Super Time Gel Top Coat at the end. The link is going to be in the description below. I would advise you to go ahead and try it out because it's an amazing finish to your set. It gives them a brilliant shine and I can't say enough about it. It's amazing. Okay? That is what I like, love, and need. I always have to have it. It's like my drug. <laughs> Anyways, this is the end of my video. So as I asked you before, if you're not yet subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and ring the bell as well. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media. The links are in the description below. And if you would like to donate to the growth of this channel, the link is also in the description below. Please, I would like to, you know, get to nail school whenever outside opens up. Corona go away. Corona go away. Go away, Corona. So I can get to nail school, please. You're holding me back, sir. You're holding me back. Anyways. <laughs> Have a wonderful time, guys. I love you. And don't forget to be fly like Regina Nails. Be fly cosmic gun. I'm out of here. Bye, guys. <laughs>